Hi there, this is Judy from Happy Holistics and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time, I hope you like what you see and end up hitting that subscribe button. If you've been here before and have been following me, you might have noticed that it's been a while since I've done one of these face to camera to YouTube to screen to face videos, simply because I was trying to figure out how to improve the audio. So fingers crossed that it's gonna work this time. So let's get right to it. You'll need argan oil, but if you're allergic to nuts, choose a different type of carrier oil. Geranium essential oil, lavender essential oil, and an empty dropper bottle. Put 10 drops each of geranium essential oil and lavender essential oil into your empty dropper bottle. I filled the rest of the bottle with argan oil, which holds 15 milliliters. I reused an empty essential oil bottle because that's what I had on hand. However, if you're doing this at home, I would suggest you use one of those squeezy dropper bottles because the oil comes out easier. Then just replace the cap and give it a little bit of a shake. Argan oil is a good antioxidant. It has vitamins A and E and other essential fatty acids to help retain moisture and to reduce inflammation. Even as a standalone product, argan is one of my favorites, unless you have nut allergies, in which case use something else. Lavender essential oil stimulates the production of antioxidants, namely glutathione, catalase, and superoxide dismutase, which helps reduce inflammation. Lavender promotes cell regeneration and improves the appearance of age spots. Geranium shares many of the same qualities as lavender and argan. It's anti-inflammatory, helps cell regeneration, and lightens dark spots. On its own, it's also said to reduce wrinkles and tone the skin. I'm not sponsored by any of the products used in this video, but if you wondered which brands I'm using, I've listed them in the description box along with where you can buy them. That's it for this week. Let me know in the comments below how your moisturizer turned out. 